Welcome everybody out there in the Rock River Valley to Catfish Academy Radio. We are still on the air and I want to remind you again that uh, the Catfish Academy Radio show is brought to you by Kodiak Outdoor Sports on North Galena and Dixon. This week I want to talk to you a little bit about a, a tournament event that's coming up and no it's not the Cabela's tournament event uh, that everybody is talking about and, and that's awesome. Uh, the Catfish Academy, we actually run a series called the Twisted Cat Series. And there's flyers out and around, but just in case you don't know what it is, May 2nd, Saturday, May 2nd, from 7.30 to 3.30, out of the Prophetstown State Park in Prophetstown, Illinois, we'll be running a tournament series. And uh, the cost of entry is $60, and we'll have people from all over the country there having a good time fishing the tournament. Uh, there's going to be a JNN Dip Bait Worm bonus, uh, the highest placing team using JNN Dip Bait Worms. Is going to win a couple of JNN hats, shirts. Uh, they're going to get a dozen packs of JNN dip bait worms, and they're also going to win a couple boat or car decals. Uh, it's going to be a great tournament, and the Provincetown Main Street organization has donated a thousand dollars of guaranteed money to this. That means if there was only three boats showed up, a thousand dollars is still going to be paid out. So make sure you get on over here, support this event. There's going to be donuts and coffee and and uh, hot dogs and drinks and chips at the at the uh, weigh in. Uh, the donuts and the coffee naturally will be uh, at the launch in the morning uh, from about six to seven thirty before we take off. So make sure they're there. Uh, you can get more. Uh, details at catfishacademy.com. So now on to this week's question of the week. Uh, I got a question this week. It said, Cat Matt, uh, what's this whole noodling thing, this noodling craze that's going on? Well, for those of you that don't know, noodling is where people are going underwater. They're sticking their hand in the holes. They're pulling out big flathead catfish that are spawning. I'm going to equate this for you so you can understand it a little bit better to the human side. You're in bed at night, you're all cozy with your significant other and you're getting ready to plan a nice big kiss okay let's say just a nice big kiss and right when you're getting ready to plant that big kiss somebody grabs you by the ankle and yanks you out of bed (laughs) that's noodling in a nutshell i don't support it it's not good for the fish you're hurting spawning flatheads and flatheads take a long time to reach mature weights and sizes leave them alone if you want to catch flatheads do it on a rod and reel take a picture put them back in the water And once again, don't forget to get out to Kodiak Outdoor Sports on North Galena Avenue in Dixon. Doc is a great guy. Uh, If he doesn't have it, he can get it. Uh, This has been Catfish Academy Radio, and we will see you next week.